Okay guys, I've got the new remote, the new Flatland remote. You might have seen that before. Uh, someone made a comment last video, they, they were, this is the clear one. It's pretty cool. Uh, so let's have a look. So map my ride, let's put it on. Let's get it. Um, map my ride, start workout. Start workout. There we go, start workout, turn it up nice and loud. So we're heading off now, we'll see what we can do. Uh, hopefully we'll do 40 Ks. I just found this epic mound that goes right round to a lookout. I didn't even know it was here. Been coming here longer than anybody before anyone, like five years ago, uh, six years ago actually, and check, it's like this maze. It's just breathtaking. It goes right to the top, we'll get the drone up up there. Well, look at this. so you wouldn't want to come here when it's watering. Wow, look how high we're climbing. It's getting narrower and narrower. This will be so cool with the drone. Never been here before. It's a good place to stop and talk about the uh, cave. Okay guys, checking in, we're at 5Ks, uh, 42 minutes, uh, as you can see there, and the battery is still on high. Obviously, we ain't done 5Ks. Check this out. How cool is this? We'll get the drone up.
checking in. Uh, we're at 10 kilometers uh, at the moment and we're at 1 hour 30 and uh, we've still got uh, a full battery but it is dropping down to 80 percent so there we go guys so I'll show you that so yeah we're looking good uh, full battery dropping down to 80 percent so I'd say it's 90 percent battery and we're done 10ks that's crazy let's push on yeah, this is awesome okay guys so so far really impressed with this battery setup it's absolutely unbelievable like you know to be traveling 10ks and you've only lost not even a bar yet it's just crazy absolutely crazy so um yeah it's it's beautiful so we're doing a really impressive result so far check this out down there so just checking in we're lost um one bar we're down to 80 percent uh crazy like that's such a good result this 50e battery is amazing this little cloud wheels yuri you're doing an amazing job. These Discovery wheels, these blues, are just beautiful. Literally. I'm not slouching off. I'm sitting on about 35. I want to get a real time result. Oh, cornering here. Wow, they grip so well, these cloud wheels. They really do. So, uh, so far, so good. We'll check in at uh, 20 k's. See you soon. 94 pulse rate. Crazy. We've had so much rain here in Sydney. Uh, it's rained for 40 days out of the last 50. And what I'm noticing, that's why I arrived this time of day, because you get the undulations of the ground with the long shadows. You can see that oh, a lot of the roots are growing through from these trees. Look at this, my favorite place I do my speed tests. There's not one single person around. <laughs> I've never seen it like this. This is just ridiculous I'll just pull up here for a second look how green the grass is this is not this is not a GoPro exaggeration that is exactly what's happened it's rained in Sydney for so long there she is let's just check how hot the motors are now I've uh, been riding for about three hours oh oh geez yeah they're hot uh, which is which is normal for, for a direct drive like this on a hot day it's actually um, 36 degrees today. The clouds are a little bit warm because of the road. But yeah, otherwise looking good. Let's check in now with the uh, range. Hey guys, checking in. Uh, we've now done 15 kilometers, as you can see on there. Uh, you can't make this shit up. <laughs> There's someone behind me. Uh, yeah, 80% uh, battery left. And one hour and uh, 46 minutes. Those motors, um, maybe 65. Uh, but it's a hot day and I've been pushing it with an extra five kilos on my back. So, so far there's been no complaints. 80% um, battery left, I've done 15 Ks. That's just ridiculously stupid. But um, like I said, this will be a good result for, um, I think the GoPro batteries will die before <laughs> these die. I do go into the night, I will be going into the night because I want to keep it cool. I don't want to hammer my boards, I look after them. I don't like to smash them. So I'm going to pull up here and have a cold drink and let them cool for half an hour, then I'll go again. So guys, thanks so much for coming for this epic journey uh, on the long range uh, Transite Carbon Hybrid. Bloody impressive board. It's one of my top favorite boards to ride at the moment. I'll talk to you more about it when we're riding in a few minutes. So we'll get back out and we'll see you guys soon. in this fantastic coffee shop here I can recommend it best coffees okay that was a nice pit stop I need that sort of break after three hours of riding um, bloody hungry and thirsty um, so yeah we're, we're only halfway through not even that we're not even a third of the way through yet so so far uh, let, let me just talk about this board um, Eduardo has done his homework on this board it is is my go-to board at the moment. Um, what it is, it's um, it's a Panzer tank. To me, it's a, a Panzer tank. Basically, 
it just does its job. It li literally just turns up and does its job every single time. It's got heaps of power, heaps of bite, whoa, heaps of power, super smooth braking. It's just a solid, well-engineered electric skateboard. One of the best I've ever ridden. So hats off to Eduardo. <laughs> a girl on her phone, not even looking on Instagram or bloody social media. Um, headphones on music, just friggin' dangerous. Um, so I'll check in at 30 k, uh, 25 k's and tell you how it's going. Um, so far, damn impressive. I love these cloud wheels, absolutely beautiful. plane going over welcome back uh, checking in well we've now finally got down to 60% battery so 60% battery and what is the case we're looking so far at uh, oh my god okay it's been three hours and ten minutes 26 kilometers 25.1 so 25 kilometers we've still got 60% battery left uh, this is just getting ridiculous I mean I've it's the coolest part of the day now it's now six 10 to 7 p.m. at night. We're not like the Northern Hemisphere. We um, we get dark around about 8.30, so it'll be pitch black here at 8.35. I've got to get my car out of the car park. I've got four national parks to get back to the car. Um, I want to move it out of there prior to sunset so I can get uh, no fine. Um, yeah, the Transite board. Well, so far I've just ridden that long, beautiful bush track all the way through, and the motors now um, are only just warm. They're about 20, 28 degrees. So uh, it's a hot day, but it's now cooling down. I, this is my witching hour. I uh, come out and ride around between three and eight o'clock at night. Uh, it's a lot cooler, no one's around, everyone's having dinner. Let's push on, we're gonna do 40 Ks I reckon. The clouds are killing it. Uh, yeah, the battery system in this is brilliant. Uh, if you haven't thought about getting an electric skateboard before or you want to get a really high quality one, this is the choice of pro riders like myself. I will pick this over anything else. Direct drive is the future. I'm loving it. Uh, and this is a monster of a board. Um, so there you go. That's the, the website. Check it out. Okay, let's push on to 30Ks. Let's see what's happening next checking. Check this out. No one in front whatsoever. No one anywhere. No one behind anywhere. And this is the Olympic Stadium. Check it out. Like no one around. It's just crazy. Tickets, please. Tickets. I don't think we've seen a show here or a sporting event for over 12, 13 months. Crazy. The sun's getting low. I'm heading back to the car. I want to get the car out of the car park. Um, right, are you ready for this? 30 kilometers. 
3 hours 30 minutes, still got 60% battery left. 60% hasn't moved. I'm easily going to do 40 k's on the cloud wheels. Probably even do, probably even do more. Uh, I'm not slowing down as you can see. I'm flying through here. 34. Be careful bike riders. This is a beautiful spot. It's a place I've just found. And um, it's just one of the most amazing little places. It's just beautiful. Okay, so that's it guys. Um, we'll check in at 35 k's. Which will be absolutely awesome. See you soon. Okay, dudes, checking in now. We're at the four hour mark. It's gonna get dark in about a half an hour. I've gotta get out of here, but I'm gonna run around here a bit more than go to the Olympic Stadium and ride around there. So I wanna run this thing right down to the end. Four hour mark, uh, we're at 35 kilometers. Check that out. 35 kilometers and we've got still, yeah. Minute, three seconds, 35 point zero kilometers. Average pace, six minutes, 49. Disregard the average pace. I stopped for a two hour lunch uh, or an hour lunch. Stop it. Um, yeah, 60% battery left. So 60% battery left and we're at the four hour mark, 35 kilometers. So, oh my gosh, it's dropping down to two. So I think it'll probably be, a, it's around 40% battery. Let's run it around here, see what we can do. I'll pick up to 35 k's an hour to really push it in a couple of hills. Okay, we'll see you soon. On the remote and we've got um, three bars. 50%. It's more like, it's actually more like, it's more like 40% because I think we're getting really low on that last bar, that foot. Okay, so all in all, you know, today, this board has been effortless. Not only did I find some incredible new uh, tracks and some new incredible exploration uh, places um, to ride, um, but I've also uh, had the most amazing experience with these cloud wheels and this is like floating. I, I, I can't express enough to you the silent drive of a direct drive with just like riding the perfect wave. It's just perfectly silent. It's very euphoric. This is going to be one of the you know, nicest long range tests I've done. Uh, I'll be honest, this board the surpassing my wildest expectations really is beautiful. Okay, now I'm testing a hill and I'm carving heavily. Really heavily. I want to showcase the last two bars of this thing. It's so far unbelievable. This is my go-to board at the moment. If you haven't considered buying an electric skateboard till now and you've got the money, 2600 get one of these. You will never look back. It is just literally near perfection, as I say all the time. Okay, so we're heading up to uh, 40 k's. Let's keep going. I'll check in with you uh, very soon. Just checking in. We're at 36 kilometers. Whoa, carving this thing like crazy. Um, yeah, we're 36 kilometers. We're at four hours, and we've still got. <laughs> We had three bars and now we've got two bars finally. So let's keep in checking out where it can go. We're just going to take some steep hills here now. Look at that view behind the sunset. Isn't that beautiful? Um, we're just going to push this at the end here just to show you what you can do. You know, 25 k's up that hill, full acceleration. So we're going to test, uh, test the full range of this thing. It's going to be really real world stuff now i'm 95 kilos you know the backpack's off now i had the backpack for most of the day that was five kilos with the drone um so i'm about 100 kilo weight today and um that is just astounding still got full acceleration look at that now if you um weigh less than that you'll get an extra five to eight maybe 10 k's more and then we're at 40 kilometers i'm in the arena here where the Olympic Games was filmed. Uh, 40 kilometers, uh, 4 hours, 17 minutes, and I'm still on 2 bar battery. Can you believe that? 40%. There's no uh, issues yet with any warning 
Uh, this is on cobblestones. You can't even hear it. These cloud wheels, just crazy. It's just checking in. I hope the GoPro is working okay in this light and the microphone. Where you can see no one, no one around. Look, check this out. Uh, it's just an, I'm going like 38, 36, 37 k's an hour. Um, just crazy. I've got to wear this thing out. We'll come back at 45. Okay, you can see I'm on the middle of the road. There's no one around. I've got my first vibration uh, saying low voltage. It's saying 25% uh, voltage left. That's in the whole, the whole board. Uh, but that doesn't mean you only got 25%, uh, like a quarter. It means you've still got probably a bit more. It's an orange light. That's cool. Um, so, yeah, I've probably, I've still got um, two bars. So, pretty, I like that warning. It's a really good warning. Okay, guys, we'll keep pushing on. I'll get back to it 48. Okay, love this time of night. Check this out in the GoPro. You can see the... The whole road is like glass. Woohoo! So we're getting more vibrations, so we are getting low. I'm not going to get too far from the car. Although I've got two bars, it's saying I've got 25% left on the board. But that's about Hey guys, we're going through this incredible exhibition for Olympics. Check this out. Um, four hours, 35 minutes. We've reached 45 kilometers and we've still got one bar battery left. Can you believe that? Just look at that. It's like the my way through the East Coast. Uh, yeah, so one bar battery left and uh, 45 kilometers. We're going to get 49, I reckon. Let's get out on that stretch of road and keep pushing it right to the end. Okay, we've still got acceleration, still got power, still got bite on one bar. Now I'm 38 k's an hour. Just to show you guys, I'm pushing it right to the end. So we're checking in now, uh, it's 47 kilometers, 47.5. Um, I'm sitting on 35 k's an hour. You can see still got bite at that speed. Um, four hours, 45 minutes, and we've got one bar left, and it's saying 10% battery. Now at this point, I wouldn't recommend riding it any lower than that, you can damage the cells. So I'm gonna head back to the car, and I'll probably get the 48 k's. That's an unbelievable result. See, this is a stretch of road I'm using just to test out the last part of the battery, which is really important. I'm not slouching off. Watch this. I'll just do a tight turn here. Right. Still got bite, still got power coming out of that turn. And picking up to 37 k's an hour. So still got plenty of power at one bar and uh, that's an unbelievable result. That's a pretty impressive result. I'm not gonna push any more, I'm gonna get back to the car. That's it for a wrap today, guys. I hope you enjoyed sustain to the end. Woohoo! And uh, we'll see you in the next video. Uh, it will be the long range just, just distance test on the beast board. But I'll give you the final summary of the car and we'll show you the route. <laughs> Sorry, I got a bit lost. Thank God I did. Look, it's still got power up this hill. Still got bite. Still got 100% bite on 6% battery. Pretty insane. Whoa! Okay. Jesus. Where are the street lights in this part of the neighborhood? This is a sketch we didn't know. That's weird. There's no lights there at all. Okay. Um, well, I got lost 
Uh, so I've now done another three or four Ks to find the car. Um, still got power. Oh, a little jerk then. So we are down to virtually empty battery. I'm getting back to the car now. I think it's gonna be a record. Let's just check while I'm riding. I gotta check. Okay, let's have a look. This could be a record for the channel. Reception here. Oh my God, come on, come on. I'm using someone's Wi-Fi here. <laughs> oh Jesus, hang on. God, 50.45 kilometers. Can you see that? Four hours, 59 minutes, that's five hours. 50.45, that is a record for the channel. Uh, the record was 40, the record was 47 with the uh, Night Fury, broken by 49 with Eduardo's Bamboo. And now, um, 49's been beaten by 50. So, uh, yeah, I have to re-change that uh, rating now to 9.9 .9 out of 10. So it's the highest rating out of any long range distance test I've done. Uh, let's get back to the car. And uh, I don't want to run out of power before I get back. So um, let's get into it. Yeah, that's just, look, it's still got bite up this hill. I, I can't believe it. Okay, here we go. There's the record, 50.56 kilometers. Um, that's a record for the channel, five hours and two minutes. To get that time, I had a lunch for an hour and a half. And there's the battery, one bar, you can sort of see still there. Um, yeah, beautiful motors. And not too hot, they're about 30 degrees, 35. Uh, that's it guys, so uh, as I said, this is a 9.9 .9 rating out of 10. Congratulations to Transite. We'll see you next video, thanks guys.